Aloha, today we're talking about Highway 132, road recovery, and temperature analysis. It has been two months since work began on Highway 132 to reclaim it from the lava of the 2018 eruption. About 3.1 miles of fresh road has been ripped and graded by road workers, despite the difficulties that working with fresh lava presents, such as Shelly Pohoihoi or high temperatures. Recently, USGS HVO geologists went to the Highway 132 road construction site and examined some of the cuts in the road. They write, quote, In places, the rock is incredibly dense and has to be slowly broken apart. This dense rock is interpreted by HVO geologists to be some of the last lava to erupt and solidify within the Fisher 8 channel. This dense rock has sheared and complex bubbles and lots of tiny olivine crystals. The drill bit used to hammer the rock into pieces gets hot from the solidified lava, which is still at 400 degrees Celsius, 752 degrees Fahrenheit, occasionally causing the bit to turn purple from the intense heat. Well, we'll leave it to the media to take something and run with it. All the media heard was drill bit purple, hot lava. That was the story, and they ran with it, along with the casual implication that the drill bit went purple because of the heat of the lava. Rather than the density of the lava in which the drill bit was being used on, it does not matter if the dense rock itself is hot. With enough strikes, friction will be able to heat the bit to the point in which it discolors. As for the reading of 750 degrees, the lava itself is quite hot beneath the surface layer, which itself is cool, but the lava itself acts as insulation. When the lava was cut for the road to go in, these inner layers were revealed. Back in December, the Puna Geothermal Venture established its own road through the lava fields and the lava channel back to its power plant. Months later, they reinstalled power poles. Some of the wooden poles installed by Helco failed due to the amount of heat retained within the surface of the lava flows. Down by the lava delta near Green Mountain, where the 750 degree measurement was pulled by USGS HVO, the lava remains quite thick. The new lava delta, which extends about 4 miles between Kapoho and Poohi, is about 70 feet deep and will likely retain its heat for years and years to come. Jumping back to Highway 132, work is ongoing and scheduled to be completed by October 5th. Current road construction plans do not include the 700 feet roughly to reestablish the lighthouse road to Kumapahi Point. And with that, mahalo everyone for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for future updates.